Welcome to South Ponte Vedra Beach, where we take you on a tour of this oceanfront estate built by Ruggieri Construction and stunning architecture by Michael Stoffer. Represented by the Rocco Group at Keller Williams, this remarkable home has everything you could imagine in a California coastal home right here in Ponte Vedra Beach. This home is situated on a large lot that is just under a half acre, featuring four bedrooms, two of which are master suites, three and a half baths, two family rooms, a flex room or man cave, and two additional flex spaces for an office or study. With approximately 4,500 square feet of living space, this home is sure to fit your needs and desires. Let's make our way up the circular driveway and on into this luxury oceanfront home so I can show you around. The first thing I notice and love about this home is you are surrounded with spectacular panoramic views. To the east, you have the Atlantic Ocean accompanied with morning sunrises. And to the west, you have Guana Preserve and Guana River, where you will enjoy never ending views of our Florida sunsets. As you walk up to this gorgeous home, you will be impressed by the oversized front porch with lots of room for rocking chairs or whatever you may like. Please enter through these double Mastercraft doors featuring one of two family rooms. The family room on this level has a coffee or wine bar with a refrigerator. Now, if you are like me, my first draw is going to be to go outside. Yet yeah, I'm gonna show you the rest of this lower story and then we'll go outside. Directly to the right of the family room is your second master suite. Let's go take a look. All of the bedrooms in this home have access to the covered porch and have full ocean views. In addition, these bedrooms feature recessed motorized window shades, which quickly converts the bedrooms from light filled and open to private and warm within seconds. This ensuite bath features Cambria quartz countertops, soft closed cabinetry, along with custom lighting and mirrors. This is one of two offices or flex rooms on this floor, allowing some peace and quiet by simply closing the doors. Throughout the entire home are hurricane impact windows and doors, because as you know, in Florida, we've seen a storm or two. All windows and doors also have internal turtle tinting. Consistently throughout the home, you will see the waterproof luxury laminate wide plank flooring, which is a necessity when living on the beach. Enter the small foyer directly into the second and third bedroom through a custom Pecky Cypress barn style door. Both bedrooms are spacious and private. The windows alone are simply gorgeous, giving expansive views of the ocean with direct access to the covered deck and on out to the water. It's all about the details in this home. Closets with sensor lighting. I just love the details that coordinate throughout this home. Directly outside of the bedroom is the guest bathroom with waterfall glass accents in the shower, coordinating wallpaper and mirror. I know I keep mentioning this, but I certainly love the intricate details like the pecky cypress inside the nook that makes it just a little bit more custom throughout. Now we're gonna go on back to the second office and the laundry room. This laundry room has everything you could think of, including a laundry chute. I love the detail in this room from the concrete tiles designed to look hand painted. You are sure to love the great water views as you're doing laundry. Last but not least is the second office or study on this floor. It's quite spacious and can certainly serve as more than just an office. Now let's head upstairs. Yet yeah, before we do, notice the shiplap detail all the way up the staircase. Honestly, the seller did not miss a single detail. Welcome to the spacious open concept family room with a gas fireplace. And there's a simple elegance to this white stacked stone wall with custom shelving and cabinetry on either side. Breathtaking views from every room. A vaulted ceiling with custom wood beams stained to coordinate with the mantle and the countertops in this particular room. 
you will consistently see similar elements carried throughout this home. And it's just another one of the details that the seller lovingly put into the home. Now adjacent to the family room is the exquisite kitchen and intricate details throughout. These picture windows looking out just above the sink is one of my favorite features. The details in the kitchen are just gorgeous from the Pompeii quartz countertops, open floating shelves, herringbone backsplash, custom built hood and island in a warm cappuccino finish coordinating like I mentioned earlier and all the way down to details such as a pot filler and a state-of-the-art refrigerator with a smart system built in where you can be at the grocery store and check your refrigerator to see if you are missing milk or eggs you name it this home is certainly designed for entertaining you have a great wine bar that holds 46 bottles of wine we also have a large walk-in pantry that can store everything that you could possibly get from Costco. Off to the side is a spacious dining area with custom banquet seating, deliberately designed with custom storage incorporated and comfortably seats 12 people. It's the absolute perfect area for entertaining family and friends over the holidays or throughout the year. Welcome to your new gorgeous owner suite. It has expansive sliding doors out to the patio. The master ceilings feature a pecky cypress tray ceiling, shiplap walls, and an abundance of natural light. On into the owner's bath through the spa vestibule, the claw foot soaking tub with separate custom vanities with Cambria quartz tops, porcelain marble like tile, with decorative mother of pearl accents that echoes the coastal lifestyle. We love this gorgeous herringbone backsplash, the oversized rain head in the shower and additional shower head. Take note of the custom closet system, including the laundry chute. The half bath on the main living area features a glass tile wall, as well as granite countertops. Let's take the elevator down to the lowest level where you will find additional flex space of 575 square feet, fully heated and cooled. This could be used as a home theater, a safe house or shelter, or as the sellers used it for a man cave and guy's corner. It's designed with the flexibility to incorporate the adjoining storage room to add additional living space. Who doesn't need more storage? Regardless of the use, it has surrounding concrete block walls, so it is built to withstand anything. Out on the porches, you will find cable railing for a modern feel that makes certain your view is not obstructed. The deck total is over 2,000 square feet, and the covered deck area is around 1,200 square feet. The foundation of this home has been secured with 57 pilings with rebar included. The full length of the house has a storage under the stairs that is waterproof dry space. It's hot mopped so the water cannot penetrate. You will see a convenient outdoor shower so you can rinse off after a day at the beach. The boardwalk to the beach is new. Fun fact, did you know that South Ponte Vedra Beach is the number one loggerhead and green turtles nesting beach in the USA? In fact, one of the turtles just laid their first egg, which we hear is supposed to be good luck. The 24 foot dunes are exclusive to this section of South Ponte Vedra Beach. You will be happy to know there is minimal flood insurance requirements in this vicinity. As far as lifestyle goes, if relaxing by the ocean isn't enough, choose to paddleboard, which is a local's favorite activity, or perhaps launch your boat at the public boat ramp and float down the intercoastal waterway. Make sure to bring your binoculars to view all the amazing Florida wildlife from eagles to dolphins that call this area home. Tie up at one of the many waterfront restaurants or dock at the public St. Augustine Marina and walk around beautiful downtown St. Augustine. So I'm here with Mike Stoffer, who is the designer and architect of this home. Thank you for joining us. 
in this beautiful home again. Um, so oftentimes you are recognized for being showcased on HGTV for some of the homes you designed, the smart homes in Jacksonville Beach. And not only Jacksonville Beach, but the HGTV dream home in St. Simons Island. Correct. Tell me a little bit about the love that went into this particular home. Well, first of all, when I design, I always try to design something that reflects what my client wants. Mm. So in this case, you know, they wanted to have a beach house. And we are fortunate and very blessed to have a magnificent lot right. that has views of both the ocean and the intercoastal waterway. Right. So as part of the design for this house, one of the key components was, first of all, wanting to do a coastal style design, but at the mm -hmm. same time, as an architect, I'm fortunate to have a magnificent site. And sometimes right. the architecture just needs to frame the beauty of the location. Okay. So in this case, being able to have the, the great views of the ocean, the great views of the intercoastal waterway, mm -hmm. that was just a key part of the design. Right. Then kind of having this open space plan also then allows us to be able to have a wonderful living space that kind of feels like you're living partly indoors and partly outdoors at the same time. Yeah, so, but best of both worlds. Best of both worlds. I love that. Mike, what would you say are the two to three most unique features of this home that would be attractive to a buyer? Well, at the risk of sounding repetitive, sort of what I said earlier about the fact that this living dining uh, kitchen area is this open space plan, and mm -hmm. then it feeds out to the porches. That's a really com big component of the design. Then as part of that, individually, we have the vaulted ceiling with the beams right. and incredible details that kind of make the indoor space special as well. The other wonderful thing about this house compared to a lot of places mm -hmm. is because of the size of the lot, every bedroom in this house has an ocean view. I noticed that. It's spectacular. Yeah. It just, you, wow. know, you don't get to do that very often because oceanfront lots are often narrow. Mm -hmm. So having the opportunity for every room to have an opportunity to view the ocean. And again, at this level, at the third floor in the main mm -hmm. living area, to be able to see both sunrises and sunsets at the same time. Right. Thank you for sharing. Is there anything else you feel would be really relevant for a buyer that's looking at buying this home? Sure. I mean, in addition to the beauty of design and the living mm -hmm. spaces and the architecture and the, you know, those kind of creative aspects, you know, a house is a practical thing as well. Correct. This house being oceanfront, um, we have this house is built extremely well. Uh, we have to design for hurricane loads. Being this close to the beach, the house is actually on pilings. Mm -hmm. uh, the foundation is 57, I believe. 57 pilings. Yeah. <laughs> and they go down to negative 15 feet above, you know, below sea level. Okay. So, you know, without getting too detailed, it keeps you here. <laughs> okay, well, awesome. Thank you so much. And now I'm going to let you go jet set off to wherever you were going. <laughs> well, thank you very much. Sound good. Pleasure. Thank you, Mike. Right. I certainly enjoy touring you around this exceptionally gorgeous home. If you would like a private tour, please reach out to our team and we would be more than happy to accommodate.